Well, one of the toughest jobs for teachers is simply keeping their students engaged and focused, but there's one particularly wet and slimy class where captivating the students is never a problem. V. Cooper explains in tonight's Vital People. Yeah, so how can you tell the difference between the two of them? These grade six students are studying at the beach. Well, the next best thing, anyway. We live on Vancouver Island. We're surrounded by water. And we all know the issues that are happening with our environment. It's really important that our kids are connected to the environment. It's really becoming a cornerstone of, of education. It has lots of two feet and it's fuzzy. It's called Sequoia in Schools, a program created by World Fisheries Trust to educate young minds on local marine ecosystems. Schools participating in the program are entrusted with an aquarium which students take care of. Every month or so, volunteers from Sequoia arrive to teach another hands-on lesson about our oceans. Teachers and students alike are very excited for the opportunity to have experiential learning, a chance to um, touch and see and smell and uh, look at all these things that they would normally just see in books or something like this. I think it's really cool. I remember when we were at the sea cucumber, like rolled over and then it was like really disgusting. This actually is the stomach right here. That's part of it. And when we go down to the beach, the kids make connections to what they've seen in these tubs. You know, they, there's a chitin, there's a, a scallop, there's a sea star, um, there's a, a sea lemons, you know, a nudibranch. So, they, they make those connections and, and the world opens up for them. Citron lemon, de mer of the sea. And you heard right, there's an extra learning component for these French immersion students. And you're learning it en français, mais oui, how is that going? Ah, uh, difficile. It's just another layer of learning offered by Sequoia. And as you can see, it applies to a lot of different, different areas. So not just science or biology or the environment, but also you can use it to learn about French or art or socials. And like sponges, the students absorb it all. The sea star, it like shoots its stomach around the clam or scallop and then digests it. Oh! <laughs> World Fisheries Trust hopes that by educating young people about our fragile oceans, they are creating adults who will fight to preserve it. This check program is brought to you in part by Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.